Hello everyone, welcome to this review of Vivaldi Browser. Vivaldi is a highly customizable web browser that stands out due to its focus on flexibility, privacy, and user control. Launched in 2016 by former Opera developers, it's designed for power users who want more than the standard browsing experience. Today, I'll take you through what Vivaldi is used for, its main features, how to use it, pricing, the pros and cons, and by the end of this review, we'll weigh whether it is a browser worth your time. Vivaldi is a browser that appeals to users looking for an alternative to more mainstream browsers like Chrome or Firefox. It's ideal for people who want to deeply customize their browsing experience. Unlike browsers that push for simplicity, Vivaldi aims to provide tools and features that cater to individual preferences, productivity, and enhance privacy. Whether you're a multitasker looking for built-in tools like note-taking and tab management, or someone who values privacy without the need for extra extensions, Vivaldi has something for you. Now let us talk about the main features. One of the most appealing aspects of Vivaldi is the high degree of customization. Users can change almost every part of the interface from the position of tabs and the layout of menus to how keyboard shortcuts and mouse gestures work. Tab management. Vivaldi shines when it comes to managing multiple tabs. It offers a variety of options like tab stacking, which lets you group multiple tabs together and tab tiling which allows you to view tabs side by side, a great feature for those who work across multiple websites simultaneously. Customizable user interface. You can move the address bar, change the browser's theme, adjust font sizes and more. It's essentially a browser that lets you shape it to your exact needs. Built-in tools. Vivaldi comes with a number of tools picked right in, like a notes panel for taking notes while browsing and the screen capture tool and a built-in email client. These eliminate the need for many third-party extensions. Privacy and security. Vivaldi places a heavy emphasis on privacy. Unlike other browsers, Vivaldi does not track or collect user data. It includes built-in ad blocker and tracker blocker functionalities. Additionally, you can sync your data across devices using end-to-end -end encryption, ensuring that your data remains secure. Customization of navigation. Vivaldi navigation tools are also highly customizable. You can use mouse gestures or set up your own keyboard shortcuts to navigate efficiently. Performance settings. You can fine-tune how the browser handles resources with features like the Hibernate tab option, which pauses on use tabs to free up memory. Cross-platform sync. Whether you're using Vivaldi on Windows, Mac OS, Linux, or Android, you can sync your settings, bookmarks, or even open tabs across devices with Vivaldi's secure synchronization feature. How is it used? Getting started with Vivaldi is straightforward but the depth of customization can take time to explore. You can begin by downloading it from the official website, which is vivaldi.com as you can see, and you will find the download button right here on top. And during installation, it allows you to import bookmarks, history, and passwords from other browsers. After installation, the setup guide walks you through the basics of customizing the interface from tab placement to theme selection. From there, users can dive deeper into features like tab stacking and keyboard shortcut configurations to optimize their experience. Vivaldi also supports extensions from Chrome Web Store, so you have access to a wide range of third-party tools if needed. However, with so many inbuilt features, you might find yourself needing fewer extensions compared to other browsers. Now, let us talk about the pricing. One of Vivaldi's biggest selling points is that it is completely free. There are no premium tiers or hidden features behind a paywall. This is quite significant given how feature-packed it is and it makes Vivaldi highly competitive, especially for those looking for a no-cost solution without compromising on functionality. How about the pros and cons of using Vivaldi? Now that we've covered the basics, let's talk about the pros. Unparalleled customization. You have control over every aspect of how the browser looks and works, making it great for power users. 
privacy focused. Vivaldi does not track user data, offering a built-in ad blocker and tracker blocker. Comprehensive tab management. Features like tab stacking and tiling make multitasking easy and efficient. Built-in tools. Vivaldi eliminates the need for many third-party extensions by integrating useful tools like notes, screen capture, and more. Free and cross-platform. It's completely free and works on multiple platforms with the ability to sync your data securely. How about the cons? Here are some drawbacks. Learning curve. With so many features and customization options, it might be overwhelming for new users or those who prefer a simple plug and play experience. Performance impact. Vivaldi's resource usage can be higher, especially with many tabs and features active, and this could slow down your computer if it's an older machine. Fewer extensions. Although you can use extensions from the Chrome Web Store, some users have reported compatibility issues with certain extensions compared to Chrome. In conclusion, Vivaldi is an impressive browser that offers something for users who want a more personalized and feature-rich browsing experience. It's not just about visiting websites, it's about doing so in a way that fits how you work and what you value. For power users and those who want privacy without sacrificing performance, Vivaldi is an excellent choice. However, if you're someone who prefers a simple, out-of-the-box browsing experience with minimal setup, you might find Vivaldi's extensive features and customization a bit overwhelming. That said, for a free browser, it offers immense value, especially for users who want full control over their browsing environment. Thank you for watching this video. Please like and share if you found it helpful, and don't forget to subscribe to our channel for more updates.